Well, today is National Pi Day. Mathematically, it's a constant shortened to 314. It also is today's date and the reason many people will splurge on their favorite sweet or savory foods. So Caleb Britt joins us live with the owner of Sweet Pea Confections to share how to celebrate in a sweet way. Good morning here with Megan Wise with Sweet Pea Confections. And so we're doing a no bake pie. Yes. We started with a crust here. So quickly yes. talk about kind of what you did to put this pie crust together. So we just did graham cracker, crumbs, sugar, and butter. That's it. And then mixed it together and pressed it into the pan using a measuring cup. That's the whole thing. Boom. Easy peasy. Yeah. So now we're gonna do the filling. For key uh, lime pie. I yes. think if you don't like key lime pie, <laughs> gel time. Too. Yeah, it's so good. And <laughs> it's, it's so, so easy. It's literally like eight ingredients for the whole thing. Mm. So um, we have some lime juice right here. This is key lime juice. You can actually find it at like every grocery store in town. It's really easy to yeah. find. But if you don't have key lime juice, you can use regular lime juice. Okay. It will taste very similar. And then I have an entire can of sweet and condensed milk. So I'm going to add this first. And when you add the lime juice and the sweet condensed milk together, it's going to thicken up pretty significantly. Okay. And that'll make it easier to mix in our cream cheese here. I don't want to splash. Go slow in the beginning. Got it. It is kind of, whoop, thank you. It is kind of messy. Okay. <clears throat> so once we've got that mostly mixed in, you can see it's already starting to thicken up. Yeah. We're gonna add our cream cheese in. This is the zest of a lime. And then some vanilla. That's the whole thing. It smells so good. Yes, it smells <laughs> like lime. <laughs> And then the cream cheese mixes in pretty well. And then um, that'll just help it thicken up a little faster. Some key lime pies are baked to help them thicken up, but you don't need, you don't need to bake this one with the cream cheese in Got there. It. So then you can see it's all mixed together like so. Yeah. All right. So after pouring, how long do you chill this? So I typically chill it at least three hours okay. just so that it's fully set, but you can see how thick it already is. Yeah, for sure. Um, and you can serve it with whipped cream or meringue or just like it is. Some people do like a chocolate syrup. And how long will this last? So uh, you can store it for up to a week in the refrigerator. It does have to stay chilled the whole time. Yeah. Um, but if, you know, if it lasts that long. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. I no hope problem you all got all. some great tips for National Pie Day and enjoy your favorite piece of pie or the entire pie. Yeah, like the whole itself. thing. Single serving. Why not? <laughs> thank you again so much. No problem at all. And we'll send these back to all the studio. Easy as pie. Thanks, Caleb. And you can learn more about the bakery at Sweet Pea Confections by Megan Wise on Facebook.